Hey guys, it's Erica. We're going to be checking out ID and New. I'm so excited for this. I really liked when um, the one she dropped caffeine. That was really fun. Really, really enjoyed that one. So I'm excited to be checking out this one. I have no idea what to expect. I don't even know if it's going to have that same sort of 80s print sound that caffeine had. We'll see what it is right now. And so <laughs> I'm excited. You know what it like. Kind of does have that sound. What is that? Are you a radio of some sort? I kind of like the beat. It's different. I dropped my ring. Oh, lyrics. Uh, it, it just kind of looks like they were to try and make it look like a video from back in the day. They try to definitely go for the 80s though. So I like that she is sticking with that sound. It's nice to see artists kind of continuously stick for like what's that? Most scripts do have like a sound, but it's it's, it's sometimes it's harder to find because it's not very out there. So when it's out there, it's easier for not music experts like myself to figure it out. I really like this music video. It's cool. The square frame and that little like blur on the side. The the funky old school transitions. The lyrics. The mic stand. I like the purple and the pink that kind of light lights are going. Oh, they red too. Surprise. It's like a, I don't know why the word unconventional comes to mind when I think of the beat, but that's what is popping in the brain. It's a sunny light. I like that shot. That fade. That dissolve. That fade. That dissolve. It kind of sounds like it should be on like a Stranger Things episode. The 80s are coming back, y'all. They come in full force. I should have worn my Hawkins Indiana shirt. I would have fit in perfectly. So I guess since it does sound like it should be like in the Stranger Things episode, where's for that 80s sound that it did what it was meant to do? Was it keyed out to look like a different color? <laughs> I mean, that's probably what they did back in the day, right? Well, I mean, it could key any color. And new ID. Oh, so she actually kind of like worked on it? That's cool that she composed it. Basecamp Studio. So I really enjoyed it. She really is kind of sticking with that late 80s sound. And I love it, especially with all this sort of real, like, trend you see of just, like, sort of, like, 80s concepts coming back with people doing, like, oh, this is very, like, um, meant to be, like, an 80s action movie or, like, Stranger Things, like, an 80s just vibe and just, like, or an old 80s or 80, like, 80s horror movies and stuff, like, just kind of just, like, playing, paying homage to a lot of those, so it kind of fits in with, like, the trends of just, like, right now and just, like, 
that old school feel like the 80s stuff so it totally works from like a trend standpoint but it's also a really good song and i really like the beat and it's very genuine to like an 80s sound which is really cool to to hear and to like see that and stuff and the music video is really cool to sort of like in that not exactly in that like wheelhouse of the concept of like an 80s but like still like the throwback with the weird bad king with the different colors and stuff and it is because it's kind of Back in the day, it looks normal back in the day, but now looking back at it, like, oh, it's ugly. But, um, yeah, but I really like the music video, I really love the song, it has really nice vibes, I love it, and stuff. So, yeah, go to Pure Thoughts and comment below what you thought about IDs and new. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you like me and want to see more of my videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos, second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, tell my Facebook page, all subscription down below, or at the end screen. Share the video with your friends. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Yeah, only magic of fate